Hidden inside the latest Minecraft snapshots is a new game breaking feature. A feature that, if left unchanged, will have a lasting impact as one of the most frustrating and annoying changes ever. At least for the redstone community. And note blocks have been changed. Only wool and wool carpets now block the sound from a note block. Covering them with other blocks now still makes it possible to play the note. This might not seem like a big deal at first. Even I thought, neat, I no longer have to leave a space above note blocks when adding sounds to my redstone boats. But then it hit me. For most redstoners, myself included, the main use of note blocks is no longer sound. Actually, quite the opposite is true. We use them as a silent, solid block that also works with observers and that is able to update other blocks like pistons. There is no other block with the same properties. Well, what's the problem then, you might ask? Didn't Mojang think of exactly this use case, when allowing you to still mute them using wool and carpets? Well, kind of. While it does in fact help in some scenarios, there are still too many cases where that simply isn't possible. Because oftentimes, especially in very compact redstone mechanisms, that spot above the node block is reserved for other redstone components. And yes, technically this change doesn't even break any redstone contraptions, but it sure makes them sound a hundred times worse. As an example, this is a slot machine I built a while ago. Here's what it sounds like in 1.18, before the changes. And here's what it sounds like in the new snapshot. Is that really the sound we want compact redstone circuits to have in the future? Because trust me, if this feature gets implemented the way it currently is, redstoners will have to choose. Do they want their machines to be compact and resource friendly? Or do they want them to sound acceptable? Out of the 24 redstone contraptions that I showcased in the last two years, 12 of them would now require heavy modification. And in some cases, it might not even be possible to keep them silent, even if you tried your best to mute all node blocks wherever possible. As a somewhat experienced redstoner, it shouldn't be the end of the world to redesign a few circuits, but you have to also think of the thousands of more redstone inexperienced players who built these machines in farms by following a tutorial and are now stuck with a bunch of noise machines in their survival base. And listen, I fully understand where Mojang is coming from here. They simply want to keep the wool interactions consistent. But this is not the way. I spoke to several other redstoners, such as Crafty Masterman and Purple Dragon Nuke, and even Cube Hamster agrees. With how it is implemented right now, the update to node blocks does a lot more harm than good. As a redstoner, I know exactly how heartbreaking it can be to go back on something you spent a lot of time and energy on. But in this case, it might just be the better option. At least until another block with similar redstone functionality is added to the game. If you feel as strongly about this change as I and many other redstoners do, please tweet this video at the devs and try to get as much attention to the topic as possible, so Mojang sees that we care. And if you are a Mojang employee watching this, I absolutely love what you're doing with the 1.19 update, and I fully understand if you do not want to revert this feature. But please at least consider it if only out of respect for the many different communities that helped make Minecraft the awesome game it is today.